have to keep it really short. <laughs> My wife said that uh, she only saw me cry once. <laughs> this is the second time. Actually, she, she doesn't know, but... I'm a pretty emotional guy. <laughs> cry inside. Well, anyways. <clears throat> I just wanna... Thank God uh, for His grace and His mercy, and, um, and the way He just blessed our ministry here. And I want to also thank the Presbytery members, Korean Central Presbytery, uh, for joining us on this special day, um, for your encouraging words and advice, and we'll definitely take it to our heart. And uh, thank you for challenging us as well. Um, as you mentioned, there's no such model that exists right now where EM and KM coexist in a session. So we do have a tall order in being those uh, challenges. Um, and uh, I want to also thank our vineyard church members. Um, know, everybody was throwing out numbers, so I'll throw out a number as well. Uh, I've been a member, not 36 years, but 35. <laughs> so I was very close. Uh, but, uh, you know, we've had a lot of changes in our EM ministry. Um, and I know you guys stuck by us all the way. Thank you, session. Uh, the previous session as well, new session, uh, for trusting us and being there for us, guiding us through. Um, and uh, recognizing uh, our leadership body and making it more formal and uh, giving us a place now in our session body. So thank you for that. And uh, let's say I want to thank uh, my, our families, um, my wife, of course. And, Yeah, we were talking about this a little bit in the past, but yeah, I love you. I love you so much. Yeah, it's kind of weak, right? Coming from a uh, guy like me, like, uh, if you saw me like walking around and you saw me saying this kind of stuff, uh, I, mean, I used to knock people out for that, but uh, uh, anyways, uh, thank you uh, for being here. And uh, you see my parents, my brother, sister. I mean, actually, you know, you guys are all my families. I know uh, many of you guys have lived a prayer on my behalf, and I thank you so much for that. And uh, I guess just a couple of things I want to share was, uh, uh, yeah, I, I know I was I was uh, preparing for this elderly exam. Uh, I took a lot of exams, but uh, this was uh, this was a tough one for sure. <laughs> um, I realized, uh, you know, I have long ways to go as far as uh, my knowledge of the Bible, you know, my wisdom, the godly wisdom, and even my desire to serve the church. Um, so I'm very humble the fact that you guys have elected me uh, to take on the role of an elder at a Vineyard Presbyterian Church. Uh, I would say that I would do my best uh, to serve, a, serve the church and the people, and, uh, and I think it's been emphasized here today, but most importantly, our God. Uh, as, uh, as I mentioned, you know, there's still a lot of unknowns on how this will all work. Um, so I pray that you will, that will continue to pray for us, uh, that um, there will be a real good communication between KM and EM, that we will we'll be able to collaborate effectively for His kingdom, you know, not for our selfish desire, for 
by Fraser's kingdom, uh, and that you know God would provide His providence over our church, and that uh, you know, ultimately we'll be able to establish a uh, good working model that uh, uh, hopefully our PCA can leverage um, to share uh, with other churches as well. Uh, yeah, please uh, continue to pray uh, that my faith and love for him will continue to grow and that uh, I'll be able to uh, have more wisdom to lead and, uh, and that he'll provide his grace uh, to concern and my desire for our church and for his people here the ABC will just continue to grow. Um, and I uh, just wanted to share one verse that I was just, uh, and it's, uh, it's a verse that, um, it's Titus chapter 2, 7 through 8. Uh, it reads, let your life stand as a pattern of good living. In all your teaching, show the strictest regard for truth, and show that you appreciate the seriousness of the matters you are dealing with. Um, I try to be a humble guy. I'm not always humble, but uh, probably especially not at home. Um, but, uh, and this is something I kind of shared in the Presbytery uh, uh, Elder Testing as well. Maybe this one got me past, but uh, I, I want to, uh, I want to live by example. Basically, uh, that's my uh, ultimate goal. I'm not going to be perfect, uh, for sure, but uh, my goal to you is to live by example, uh, and hopefully that will help change lives. Um, uh, that said, no more sorry now. <laughs> Thank you.